guys welcome back to my channel golden roots my name is Ikari and you are all welcome to this channel so in this video I wanted to talk about or mostly tell you guys that I decided to dye my hair okay so this is all from the last video whereby I am holding the dye that I'll be using I don't know if any of you guys have used this all right so from the last video if you watched it I had a method on how to fix uh, broken locks or damaged locks and I wanted to share with you guys that I thought my hair would blend in more if I dyed it black so I'm kind of saying bye to these highlights right now and I just saw that it will look more natural as that hair or extension grows in its natural state so all of you guys if you've been following me know that I have had this hair uh, colored from the time that it was short when I had a big chop uh, from thick locks that I had before and I just wanted to change the color and anyway long story short we'll be coloring the hair so I got this in boots if you're in Ireland make sure you try this this is also for curly hair this is what the box looks like I haven't tried this before so it actually said it was suitable for people who are, have curly hair people who have natural hair so I thought that why not let's try it out and I just wanted to welcome you guys who are new to this channel because I always say that in my intro and I never say it now so you guys are more than welcome I'm going to quickly unpack this and show you guys what comes in this particular package I have my window open it's 29 degrees today today is um, what date is it today today is the 8th of September 2023 and it's hot in Ireland today it's 29 degrees highest so it comes with a flyer like so with instruct not a flyer instruction book <laughs> and it's got this uh, natural color activator yeah I hope you all can see that so it's easy applicating bottle and there is a color enhancing cream it's focusing and then there is I'm guessing a conditioner with coconut and aloe vera so it says conditioning color uh, natural instincts let me read this okay <laughs> instead of just showing you the bottle I will have the description down in the information box uh, description box if there is some on Amazon I'll just put a link I'm sure I'm not sure if it's there but if you're in Ireland or UK you should be able to find this so it's called uh, Clyro natural instincts conditioning color with coconut oil and aloe vera and then it comes with a coconut shine conditioner which I don't use conditioner on my locks so I wouldn't advise this because of product buildup what we're trying to achieve is just the color itself so I wouldn't really be so keen in you know using a conditioner and then there's just a pair of gloves so we're gonna get started I'm going to quickly jump into the video and probably fast forward this part so that we are on the go okay shaking this mixing up uh, the two and I am going to show you guys my hair for the last time I just have to bring this hair tight down and remember to wear a towel uh, just to protect your clothing I have a towel here I made sure it's a brown towel sis cuz we don't want to stain things and I know I have makeup on but guys I get a chance to record I'm gonna record all right so say goodbye 
apply to this hair and we're going to get started so first of all always make sure you read instructions so I'm just gonna quickly go through it says that apply all over starting at the roots uh, you have to apply the color mixture and it has to be dry and washed hair so you can't apply to hair that's wet or anything and you're supposed to work through your hair um, so this is uh, if you have not colored your hair in more than three months and I forgot to say is this a semi-permanent color uh, the color says it lasts 28 shampoos uh, blends away gray hair so if you're struggling with that um, we'll see how it goes it just says 80% naturally derived ingredients so that's why I kind of picked this I haven't used this before last time before I colored my hair in case people have a question I used L'Oreal and it was just a normal bleach I had to bleach my hair first and then color it so this is straight into already bleached colored ends and it says that you leave through you work through your hair and leave the color mixture my windows open in case it's loud you leave the color mixture in for 20 minutes so well if you color every one to three months there's also different um, instructions for you and I'm not planning to color every one to three months so whatever color comes out of it at the end of the three months I think I'll just keep that I don't want to become someone who often colors their hair so I'm just trying to figure out how to get this off mm -hmm. I think you can cut it off or buy it I don't know what you can do sis so I'm just gonna kind of share the hair in the middle And my main focus is the ends and I'll just bring the towel around my neck only because I'm using my arms the focus is mainly the tips as soon as I am done focusing on that then we can see okay that's the color there and I am no professional at this so this is something that we do DIY at home and I'm just showing you you can get it done too so I will fast forward this part and be back pretty much um, managed to apply the whole head so I'm just gonna show you guys how it looks I can already see that it's turning darker on this side um, the color is gone guys it's honestly gone and I'm like freaking out right now but we are welcoming change and make sure that if you're using this it's quite runny so I used a brown towel I'm not really worried about it getting stained but just make sure that um, you are maybe applying the product to your hand instead of uh, applying directly because it was kind of slipping through and falling onto the towel but I will just quickly show you guys a close-up on how the hair looks quickly So we're going to count 20 minutes from now and after 20 minutes I'll be back to, she, um, to show you guys how the hair is but it's quite rapid it changes so quickly and I'm excited for this new color I wanted to make sure that I finish off everything 
and I am able to apply also on the end so that the color isn't too different just kind of a, trying to avoid the roots but just the ends y'all so I'll be back guys so it has been 20 minutes and we're just gonna go quickly through and see how different it looks close up you know I'm actually using a mirror and I hope I didn't miss any lock okay and also careful with your face when you're using this I had to wipe the sides one of my fingers got caught up I'm gonna rinse this off and show you guys the end result okay guys I have washed the hair and I was just letting it dry and while I do that I was just refreshing my makeup don't ever do dye when you're ready to go somewhere i had to fit this in because my child took a nap so we're trying to fit in things okay so i just wanted to say i felt like it was really dark but i just felt like it's jet black <laughs> Why? What's wrong with being black? Oh, it's so jet black. I feel like those um, gothic people. No. You're looking at yourself, not me. Because I can see you. Can I see me? Oh. Okay. Fine. So I applied oil and I just wanted to let it dry. So that I show you guys when the hair is dry but so far this is the color now and I just want it to air dry I'm going to go do my nails and then I'll be back and I'll show you guys what it looks like and it should be dry that time so I'll see you guys later so I am back from doing my nails this is what I had done my hands are kind of ashy but I wanted something red and coffin nails so my hair has now dried up and it's sometime in the evening now it's been such a bright day and I wanted to just say something about this color it's color black number two but I felt like the black that I was expecting from this color is a bit I don't know if you tell me you guys maybe I'm tripping I feel like it's a bit darker than I expected but i am going to get used to it and i think sometimes when you're used to color or having color in your hair you might feel like it's gotten too black uh let me know what you guys think but i think it blends in well so this is the end result guys i just wanted to show you guys um uh, what it looks like feels a bit dry already even though i applied oil to um to seal in moisture but I'm just going to keep, uh, you know, adding uh, hair spritz and whatnot just to make sure that we are not having some dry locks here. So I just wanted to also show you guys a 360 of the hair. I'll make sure to zoom out so that you guys see. to um, 
I have mixed feelings about this color guys I'm just trying to be honest okay I really like the change I like the whole dark color it's blending in with uh, those extensions that I did a week ago it feels rather dry but obviously there was a conditioner to follow up with it after using it so if you're using a natural hair maybe uh, after using the conditioner it will feel less dry but I can feel that it feels drier than usual I will just keep up with my uh, morning routines where I hydrate uh, with the spray and I use oil but so far I think that it did a good job in covering all the color that was there I just really I'm trying to show you guys its natural color state as it would be and you can tell that there's still some oil in that hair but it feels dry so this is something that's bound to happen after using color and like I said I don't plan to use color sorry guys the window is open it's hot today I don't plan to use color often so this is a one-time thing and I'll keep you guys updated so that's from using that and if someone had questions on that color um, I wasn't sure if this black number one or two or another color but this is black number two so if you're looking to use that that's all I have to share with you guys and hope you liked this video so if you guys are new to my channel remember to subscribe guys subscribe thumbs up this video so that you don't miss videos like this and for all those who are tuned in who are already subscribed to this channel I really really appreciate your support I appreciate everything that you guys do uh, in commenting and all the thumbs up sharing the videos I really really appreciate you guys so let's keep the family growing I really really hope I'm bringing content that people like and I'm just gonna keep up with consistency I'll see you guys in my next video until next time bye